So here's a little update already. I'm still working on this Sunday, and uh, I was able to, with the help of my right OB tools, I got this awesome jigsaw and a sheet sander. So with the Ryobi tools, I was able to cut out some of the pieces, and then with the Ryobi sheet sander, I was able to sand parts of the trailer that I can see. You know, got the rust off, stripped it down as smooth as I could, and then I turned around and painted it with the Rust-Oleum Stop Rust. So got a good primer coat on there. Um, also cleaned up underneath the frame where I'm going to slide in the plywood flooring. So let me just tell you, all these little holes right here had some uh, self-drilling uh, screws in there that were all stuck. The, the heads were not stripped, but they were spinning in place, uh, self-sinking, I guess they're called. Um, and the way I had to get them out was to use a little crowbar underneath the screw because they came all the way under here and I can't slide any plywood in there with those screws in the way. So I had to get them all out and had to use a little crowbar underneath and then if they uh, didn't grab and come out on their own I had to use a set of pliers just to kind of pull them and guide them out. So. And to get all of those, I think all but about two or three of them were spinning in place and had to be pulled out. So that was a fun little adventure, but thank God I have the Ryobi tools. So well on my way to having a nice painted rust-free trailer. I'm going to do it, might as well do it right. Cleaned all the cobwebs out of this area. This is the front wall towards the tongue. Got it all cleaned and prepped and ready for some flooring. So now I just got to uh, get the rest of it done. <laughs>